A troubled South Memphis apartment complex is back in the news tonight after yet another tenant contacted ABC 24 about the deplorable living conditions there. Last week we told you about several tenants at Cane Creek Apartments dealing with sewage water flooding their apartments. And today our ABC 24 Scott Mattis has yet another story with a woman who has a completely different problem. Scott, what did she tell you? Yeah, good evening. Live here at King Creek in South Memphis. And it was only a few short hours after I did that initial story last week that my phone started ringing with more tenants that live here having different problems. This time it's an air conditioner. And while it might feel almost chilly outside right now over the last month, it was not so chilly. When I walked into her apartment, I said, you've got to be kidding me. Something needs to change. This is Cane Creek Apartments in Memphis. You might remember I was here recently when a viewer contacted me about the unsafe living conditions in multiple apartments. It's disgusting and it's feces water. And this is Shakidra Butterfield. She also lives at Cane Creek and tells me while she might not be having raw sewage issues, she says she hasn't had air conditioning since she moved in nearly a month ago. It has been days where we literally are in here sweating and like I had to go to my mother's house and get her fans. But there's more to this story. The only reason why Butterfield lives at Cane Creek is because she recently had a house fire and desperately needed a new home for her and her family. I was not comfortable then and I'm not comfortable now. Aside from the lack of AC, Butterfield tells me the apartment is crawling with bugs and many of the lights and electrical sockets simply don't work. And the maintenance man that was here, he quit. So we don't even have a maintenance man. Butterfield says she's called management to complain since the day she moved in and every day in between, but no progress. So at the end of this day, just like the last day I was here, there seems to be no resolution. What do you want? What I want is for them to like fix their, like fix your apartment. All right, Miss Barterfield, while well, she's still trying to get out of the Cane Creek apartment complex, now she has been saving money that she will use to move into a different apartment complex, possibly with some help. Now, the bottom line to the, this, this big story is Miss Butterfield is not alone. If you are watching and you are somewhere anywhere in the Mid-South and you have a problem that needs to be solved, we seek solutions. Call us at ABC24 or email me. I'll be watching out for those. For now, live in South Memphis. I'm Scott Mattis.